This video will cover the basic installation of Phil Wright's NX25-120 and NX25-240AC continuous duty fuel transfer pumps onto a tank. These pumps are equipped with Phil Wright's proprietary Nextech Intelligence technology. First, measure the depth of your tank to purchase the appropriate length of pipe for your tank. We recommend a 1 and 1 quarter inch black iron pipe for your suction pipe. Cut the pipe at least 3 inches short of the bottom of the tank at a 45 degree angle to ensure a clear flow path into the suction pipe. Clear any debris that remains after cutting the pipe to prevent metal shavings from entering the pump. First, disassemble the pump's bung adapter from the pump. Set aside the provided screen and seal. Next, apply thread sealant to the threads of the pipe and bung adapter. Then thread the pipe into the bung adapter until it is hand tight. Using a pipe wrench, go one and a half to three full turns past hand tight to ensure a fluid tight seal. Now you can install the suction pipe and bung adapter into the tank. Use a pipe wrench to tighten. Now you're ready to install the pump. First, install the screen and seal between the bung adapter and the pump. Make sure the screen is properly seated in the indentation of the bung adapter before installing the seal. Failure to properly seat the screen can result in fluid leakage. Then mount the pump on the bung adapter and secure it with the four fasteners provided. This may require two people. We recommend installing the fasteners in a diagonal order to ensure proper seating of the seal and the pump to the bung adapter. Finally, attach the nozzle boot to the switch plate and secure it using the provided fasteners. The nozzle boot has two available position placements. Make sure all pumps are wired by a licensed electrician in compliance with all local, state, and national codes. Thank you for watching this Phil Wright installation video.